then swish. They immediately went over, grabbed her, beat her, they broke her collarbone. We were sick and tired of being preyed upon. It's the first copy of The Advocate, September of 1967, a Pride publication. The Advocate has always been there. The Advocate is no longer fringe. At the time when The Advocate started in 1967, people were being incarcerated for being openly gay. It was a gay train. The 300 gay men were going and five lesbians that wouldn't talk to them. We were no Eleanor and Franklin no. Wilson, were we? I got to write the best headline of all time, Anita Bryan gets her just dessert. Well, at least it's a fruit pie. Both Mayor Moscone and Supervisor Harvey Milk have been shot. I was actually one of the people who found Harvey's body. Scientists at the National Centers for Disease Control released the results of a study which shows that the lifestyle of some male homosexuals has triggered an epidemic. Obviously, there were more chorus boys who got the virus than nuns. Death didn't scare me. It was living with this for a long time. That's more frightening than uh, than death. Early Frost was right there with an NBC groundbreaking drama about AIDS. Who else was doing television movies about the AIDS crisis? When you love your child and you have to sit by and watch a disease like this deteriorate the body that you gave birth to, just wrap it, take it. It's hard to accept. It just changed my life totally. Supreme Court of the United States case, U.S. v. Windsor, successfully overturned Section 3 of the Defense of Marriage Act and was considered a landmark legal victory for same-sex marriage. The realities of changing times. Being queer gives you all sorts of ammunition and strength. You just have to learn to use it. I'm gonna start an it's not radical. It's just people saying, we want to live. And I thought, you know what, kind of in my heart and my soul to say, live my life authentically. The lesbian equivalent to Grinder. The closest thing we have, animal rescue. We have the imagination and the power. The future is not in front of you, it's inside of you. It's our decisions at the end of the day, not conditions that determine our fate and determine our future. We're not finished yet until the whole world understands what human rights means. Did I think about hope is a belief that our tomorrows can be better than our today's, and that is what keeps me in the fight every day. We are our brother's keepers. I am honored to be part of this battle, and I will continue to be for the rest of my life, and if possible, from the great beyond as well. We are here, and we are queer, and we ain't going nowhere. I hope people understand that they are going to be called upon to fight in a way that I think the younger generation has not yet personally experienced. I think we're up to that challenge.